Hey, hey, hey! Who is Lee Jun-ho and what was his life like? Before moving on, please click on the subscribe button and bell for notification for Korean stars that we cover. Lee Jun-ho was born on 25th January 1990 in Ilsan-gu, Goyang, Gyeonggi-do, South Korea and his star sign is Aquarius. He is 178 cm tall. He has an elder sister and apparently he came from the Lee Jeonju clan and is a descendant of the Hyoryong prince of Joseon. During his school days, he was a member of the theater club. Lee Jun-ho took an undergraduate program at Hoan University with his bandmates Chan Sung and Woo Young. In addition, along with Chan Sung, he is continuing a master's degree in cinematography at Sejong University. He also holds a master's degree in film art. Before his debut, Lee Jun-ho first gained public attention when he won Superstar Survival in 2006. He signed a contract with JYP Entertainment after winning the contest, placing first out of 6,500 competitors. In 2008, he took part in Mnet's Hot Blood Men, which follows the extreme training of 13 trainees in order to become a member of the boy band One Day. One Day spawned two boy bands, 2 a.m. and 2 p.m. Six months after Hot Blood was aired on TV, 2 p.m. debuted with their first single. 10 points out of 10 points from their first EP, Hottest Time of the Day. But it wasn't until their second EP, 2 p.m. Time for Change, which skyrocketed their success in Korean music industry. In 2010, he became a cast member for Let's Go Dream Team Season 2. In 2011, he made a cameo appearance in the film, White, The Melody of the Curse. Since that year, he has also been composing music for his band, performing in four studio albums, eight extended plays, various singles, and original soundtrack. In 2012, Lee Jun-ho coupled with actress Kim so Eun on NBC's music and lyrics for the song Sad Love, written by Kim so Eun and composed by himself. Lee Jun-ho made his film debut in the action thriller Cold Eyes in 2013, where he impressed viewers for his acting. The film was a success and broke 4.5 million admissions. He also narrated in the film, The Terror Live. In 2015, Lee Jun-ho featured in the martial arts period drama film, Memories of the Sword, acting as Kim go euns love interest. Then he starred alongside Kim Woo-bin and Kang han il in the coming-of-age film, 20. In 2016, Lee Jun-ho had a supporting role in thriller drama, Memory, and made a cameo appearance as himself in Uncontrollably Fun. In 2017, Lee Jun-ho starred in the hit office comedy drama, Good Manager, also known as Chief Kim, alongside Nam Gong-min. He was praised for his villainous acting in the drama as the arrogant director of finance. In the same year, he landed his first lead role in the romantic melodrama series, Rain or Shine. In 2018, he was cast in the romantic comedy drama, Walk of Love, playing a star chef. In 2019, Lee Jun-ho was cast in his first Japanese movie, Rose and Tulip, written by popular manga artist Akiko Higashimura, where he played a double role. Then, in the historical comedy film, Kibang Bachelor, and the legal drama, Confession. In November 2021, he starred in the historical romance, The Red Sleeve, alongside Lee Se-young as a character whose depiction was based on a real historical figure, Royal Consort Song Ui bin He also made two music video appearances in Should Have Known and No Good In Goodbye by 2AM. He will also be hosting MBC Gayo Dejejeon 2021 with Imuna and Jung Sun Kyu. He earned the nickname Little Rain after his appearance in a program because viewers think he resembles the singer Rain. He has almost 2 million followers on Instagram and his net worth is said to be about 1 to 5 million dollars. What is upcoming for Lee Jun Ho? Do you know? Please leave us a comment down below if you do and see you on the next one.